Good day, ladies and gentlemen. My name is Daniel Umstead, host of the RNG Radio Show. And y'all already heard about me, credit repair, real estate, and all that. I got the king, yes, the king himself, King Zavre Burst, right here on the RNG Radio Show to discuss about Burst Wealth Advisors, along with a few other things uh, to get you financially and ready prepared to get into the real estate game and so much more. King Zavre, how are you doing today, my brother? Man, Daniel, I'm awesome. I'm, it's just a blessing to be in your presence, my brother. So I'm doing great today. How about you? I'm doing good. I'm doing good. So uh, I brought you on the show uh, because I wanted uh, folks to learn more about that wealth, but we're going to get to that in a second. Tell us all about uh, Burst Wealth Advisors and what it's all about. Well, Burst Wealth Advisors is basically, I, you know, I'm just like yourself. I'm a realtor. And one of the key things um, that we find ourselves doing is advising our clients. And so Burst Wealth Advisors is mainly an advisory type company to advise certain clients that even though there's a lot of things that we do in regards to showing an individual how to get qualified for a mortgage, how to set up their inspections and all of that. But there's a lot of clients that we run into that they're just totally lost. And it becomes to, and I know you can attest to this, it becomes to more of a advisory role, so to speak, than just a realtor role. And so I decided to, once I partnered up with another company to start Burst Wealth Advisors, basically just advising my clients how to get from ground zero to being a hero or a shero. Okay, I like that. I like that. Now, I know that you're uh, based out in Florida, I myself and PA, uh, with Burst Wealth Advisors. Is it strictly for Florida residents only, or can everybody uh, who's within the United States take advantage of this? Everyone around the United States can take advantage of this. Um, I, to be honest, I talk to a lot of people um, from around the country. I haven't really talked to anyone in the Philadelphia area, but New York, Chicago, um, California, Texas. So I didn't, I haven't been around, but predominantly, predominantly because this is where my business is at, is I've been doing a lot of my business right here in my backyard in Gainesville, Florida, Jacksonville, Florida, and even some parts of South Georgia. Awesome, awesome, awesome. And how long has a Burst Wealth Advisors been around for? Um, it got started actually a year and a, about a year and a half ago. Okay. Um, again, it was it was it was an idea that really came to me. You know how you have something that comes to you and it's like two, three ideas, and then you can just incorporate them. And so it was like that. It was one opportunity that came, and then I went to thinking. I was saying to myself, I say, me and my wife. And we were saying to ourselves that we need to incorporate this as an advisory company, as well as real estate, as well as the wealth part, which we'll get into a little bit later. Awesome. Awesome. I, I really love hearing that, um, uh, especially with that partnership uh, with your wife, of course, your uh, fellow queen. Now, uh, King, uh, what I do want to know is, though, how can folks actually get in contact with you? I know we're going to get into more about what the company does, but if somebody just wants to stop right now, they need assistance ASAP. Stop the interview, folks. Pay attention. Uh, King Zavre, how can they get in contact with you? Call me. I'm, I'm, I'm only a phone call away. I work by my phone, or you can text me and say, hey, I heard your interview on Daniel Umstead on radio show, and I, and then I said the name right. I might not have said it right, but I heard you on Daniel um, show, and I just want to get back in um, contact with you to, to just to share some more information about what I heard. So they can reach me at 352-443-1396. Again, that number is 352-443-1396. Or you can send me an email to burstwealthadvisors at gmail.com. And that's just straight across, right? B-U-R-S-E, wealthadvisors at gmail.com? Straight across, no hyphens, no dots, or anything. All lowercase, just shooting an email. Okay, cool, cool, cool. And then um, tell me something. Now, with your home based model that you have, how is this helping like the average home buyer in the Gainesville, Florida area, or even um, in some of the areas that you had talked about? Well, the main thing that I, I know you know this is being a realtor. One of the, it's not just the credit part that we run into, it's the debt to income ratio part. Yes. And when I ran into this program, I was like, wow. I, you know, to be honest, Daniel, I, I, I cut all the fat. You know how we take a, we have a lot of fat as far as marketing arsenals and different things that we utilize to 
you know, generate referral business. I cut all of that out because I said, I don't want to need that. Because with this one program, I'm helping people. When I first joined it, I'm going to share a true story with you. I had a client named Stephanie. Stephanie was trying to get into a $200,000 house. All right. Here in Gainesville, how should I say this? If you're... If you're at 150 or less, you're going to be pretty much on one side of town or somewhere where you really don't want to be. And that's kind of crazy at $150,000. Um, so you got to at least be at $200,000 or higher to get on the northwest side of Gainesville, which is in okay. better school zone, better area, um, better walking areas and different things like that. And so I took this program. She had good income, but most of that income was going towards the federal government at a 0% interest rate, meaning that it was going out of her taxes, all right? The taxes that she was paying, that income, she put back a little over $500 a month in her paycheck. Now, yes, now you and I know that every 53 to $55 get them an additional $10,000 and more right. that they can afford. So by us and our team of experts restructuring their W-4, she was instantly able to qualify for $225,000. Wow. That, that's an awesome success story, yeah. man. Awesome yeah. success story. You know, you, you hear about the, oh, you know, uh, people were able to get their dream home, but nobody ever hears the uh, realtor testimonial in assisting those uh, getting the dream home. All they usually see is uh, the house with the key, and it's like, oh, man, well, I knew they had good credit, or I knew they had a good job, but actually mm -hmm. hearing it from the other side, or I should say the person doing the actual work, uh, hearing from the other side, but that's a great, great story here. Now, um, with an addition as far as, um, you know, uh, getting into that house, how else uh, with the Burst Wealth Advisors, because I did see something on there as far as helping them create wealth. How does that work and flow with that as well? Well, the main thing, as you know, with I, I say this, that most people, we don't know that our income is being shifted away from. So the first thing we do, and I want to just follow, just follow me real briefly. First thing we do is help them shift that income back into their pocket to where now they have more income. The second thing we do is pretty much like something what you do. We also have a credit portion that goes along with it. Once they have a higher credit score, they're paying lower insurance premium, lower in interest rate. Then we have a system that eliminates all of their debt. Once we get them where they have zero debt, and my wife and I can attest to this, we shift, we only been in our new home for four years. We haven't did a refi or anything like that, but we didn't pay down our mortgage till we got less than 15 years, and we only been in it for four years. Using wow. This now, get this. Once we have more cash flow, now we can put into investment strategies, private banking, the same system that the Rockefeller used, cash flow banking. There's a lot of different programs out there. We yeah. have a program like that to where we show you how to protect your money tax-free with no risk of loss. And guess what? You and I don't have to be the experts. We just pass along to the experts and we get rewarded for doing so. That is a beautiful thing, man. Really beautiful thing. All right. So, uh, folks, I hope you're listening to uh, Zybra here right on this uh, RNG radio show. So he's saying that he's going to be helping you. He's going to be helping you get into the house that you deserve and the house that you want and the house that uh, was set for you. Not only that, uh, there's a program put in place where it's creating that additional wealth for you so you're not being burdened. Because the worst thing that somebody can do for anybody is, hey, I got you debt free. Let me show you all the debt that you should be having now. So uh, Zabre is doing the quite opposite in, in regards to actually getting you to a point where you're becoming financially wealthy. Now, um, I want to know the importance because I, I work from home um, just with the main job and then, of course, with real estate as well, among the other uh, different hats that I wear. Why is it such important, though, uh, for um, homeowners right now to need a home-based uh, business model, uh, especially with everything going on right now? Wow, man. Now, that is the lottery ticket right there. I tell people <laughs> all the time, I say, you know, we go to the lottery, we go to the little convenience store, and we get a scratch off or we pay a, play a number. But the real number to play 
it is a home-based business. Imagine like you say, you have a home-based business, your realtor has been a realtor, you really have a home-based business, you know, because you work from home or from your office and you got a certain square footage that you're gonna work in, correct? correct. Meaning you got a desk, you got a trash can, make sure you have that trash can. If you don't believe me, Go to 585 publication of the IRS, IRS publication 585, and they tell you you must have a trash can to get that square footage of area. Take a snapshot of it. Now, let's just think about this, Daniel. By having a home-based business, we now can write off our internet. We now can write off a portion of our utility bill, um, our gas, or our electricity to that home. You know, write that off. I know you're in Pennsylvania where it's deregulated. So those things can be written off. And if there are so many other things of the value of a home-based business, other than just those tax runners. You know, I look at it as waking up in the morning, not having to go to a commute or jump in your car. You just crank up your laptop or crank up your phone and you go to work right in your peaceful home. And right now, if I was still... Uh, in the corporate world, I wouldn't want to go to work. I no, would be terrified. I would be terrified because I'm saying to myself and my wife, not only she's a realtor, she's an auditor for a utility company right here in town, right? And I want to just say this because you asked something. I want to just say this for the people that's listening. Um, I almost slipped on it. Nationwide. Nationwide just closed their whole office here in Gainesville, their whole building, shut it down. All of their employees are working from home. Hmm. But they don't get the tax trials mm. as a home-based business. And so I was sharing this with a friend. I was like, now more than ever, you need to have a home-based business. I don't care if you sign up with me or anyone just for knowledge of sharing this with you. You need to have a home-based business because now you're going to be working from home, but you're not being able to write off any of the, uh, take advantage of any of the tax advantages from having a home-based business. So the power of having a home-based business is even if you have a job, I tell people have a home-based business because now you can keep more of your income from your W-2 employment. Now you can write off the gas that you're driving or the mileage that you're driving to work. Because guess what, Daniel? If I just say I, I bake cakes, you and I work together, but I see you every day at work, all right? Hey, Daniel, man, I'm gonna be baking a, a nice red velvet cake this weekend. I'm gonna be selling them for $25. Have I just conducted business by offering you and marketing to you that I sell cakes? Right? Right, right. Oh, I thought you had broke up a little no, bit. Well, I'll, ask, I'll ask you a question. I say, but I'm, I'm doing business right now, even though we're exactly. working at That connection, state. that networking. Yeah, we're networking. So even that, but people don't understand this because we haven't been taught the values and how to run a home-based business. And even though you may have a job, but you're still connecting with people at your place of employment, you can still write off those mileage because... I'm quite sure you're talking to somebody about your business. If you're not, you should. You should. <laughs> that that was simultaneous right there, man. I'm like, you should. You, you should. should. You so, should. and I want to actually add on to that, uh, you know, so people can get this clear picture, what we mean by writing it off. And I want to bring it down to not making offense to anybody at all that's listening, but I want you, uh, ladies and gentlemen, to understand something. When we're talking about a cell phone, you know, this device, your Samsung, your Android, your iPhone, what have you, instead of you just saying like, ah, the bill's due again, no, it should be more of I'm putting my monthly bill to the side because I'm going to be able to write it off. Because the question that I was asked, and this is just for the Pennsylvania folks, I know it's going to be different everywhere else, but I'm pretty sure it's streamlined to be the same thing. My accountant for h &R Block had said, hey, how? what's the percentage that you use your phone for business? 70, 80%, probably more than that. I haven't kept track, but I doubt he, and his question was, so you're sure that it's more than 50%? Yeah, it definitely is. Okay, cool. 
line up your bills, and we'll calculate that up. So folks, instead of it being, now for me, I got a good deal. I'm only paying $49 a month. But for the other folks, because I used to be y'all where it was 300, 160, 170. But for the other folks where it's like, man, you know, I got this crazy bill. Well, hey, once you have that business, and once you start texting, utilizing it, making phone calls, even your connection meetings, as Avery was talking about, you know, getting connected with other people at work through your phone, that counts as a write-up because you're using it for your business, okay? The mileage that you get to work to have a meeting, your lunch meeting that you're having with your coworker, discussing, hey, I just heard on the RNG radio show, this guy is Avery Burst about his business. I want to talk to you more about it. Do you have a minute to talk? Here, I'll treat you to lunch. It's not so much treating, you get the money right back, folks. So understand that there's certain things that you can write off and there's certain things that you cannot write off. But to get started with all that, the best person to reach out to will be Zavre Burst. And you know I got to do a plug-in for you, brother. So how can folks get in contact with you again? Hey, they can get in contact with me at 352-443-1396. Text me cash flow so I know that you saw this information on Daniel RNG Show and I'm going to take care of you. We're going to get you moving forward to the path of wealth, moving forward to you health and cash flow in your pocket. Love that, man. Love that. Now, what uh, what things do you foresee for the future for uh, Burst Wealth Advisors? Oh, man, that's a great question. I, I see a lot of beaches, a lot of vacations. Um, I see a lot of people that we have helped that are just really thankful and grateful that they either connected with us, was connected with us via, you know, shows like yourself and other shows that I do. Um, Cause I connect with a lot of people like yourself. And I, again, my brother, I want to thank you. I want to thank you for allowing me to speak on your show. So um, I, I love helping people. My wife and I, we, we, we just have a heart to helping people. I believe that once you get in information that you shouldn't hold on to it, you know, because this information is special, especially, you know what I mean? Especially we need this information more than ever now, more than ever we need this information. Because let's be honest, um, if you go to the grocery store lately, you can see that prices are going up. Most of us, income is not going up. Right. And so we need to be able to create cash flow. And one of the other things that, if you don't mind, let me just plug this in. One of the Definitely. other things we do as well is we have a program that we just partner up with a company that will reduce, I want y'all to hear me clearly, will reduce all your monthly bills, meaning mm -hmm. your gas, your electricity. I think I may have touched a little bit, but there's also your cable bills, your satellite bills, your pest control bills, your water bills, um, and even other bills. If you think you can probably get, or we maybe can work with you and get your bills reduced, only thing you gotta do is just upload your bills into a portal, and then we'll go to work and start calling your bill collectors or your utility companies and seeing if we can get those reduced. Like for people like yourself in Philadelphia, I know we can help people like yourself because it's deregulated. And so most people don't know that, and I'm just using this for an example, um, ABC electricity may be cheaper than um, Delphia, Philadelphia energy or something. I'm just using some fictitious. Right, right, right. And so, but if you got Philadelphia energy and ABC energy over here cheaper, you know, we're going to use them against each other. You know, we're going to tell Philadelphia Energy, hey, you know, ABC Energy is cheaper, you know, over here. Um, my client is looking to reduce his bill to what the average rate is. Can you work with them? If we save you money, you know, we work out a rate to where, let's just say we save you $100. You only pay us $40 a month, but you're 60 to the good. Are you following me? Yeah. So, that's a way, By the that way you're you saving and you're putting their money towards you. So, folks, here's the thing about building wealth. A lot of people, uh, and not to cut you off, Zabra, a lot of people think that, oh, I saved $60 or I was able to get $50 back. That money is not so much should be going back in your pocket, spending on other things. It needs to be actually put and used towards as a tool. If you're saving up for a house, okay, so that $50 you have right now, now gets put towards that house. There are so many things that are gonna be costing you in the long run and using credit cards or getting gifts from your relatives 
isn't going to help you in the long run if you can't manage the money that you're currently getting right now. Because the worst thing that can happen is Zabre goes through all this trouble of getting you set up in your house, getting your bills down to where it needs to be at, and then you're going back to square one where your credit score went from a – Went from a 500 to a 720, and then a 720 to a 490. That's not how this works, and that's not how none of us are who are in the positions we're at right now in creating that massive generational wealth. You said it perfectly, my brother. Perfectly. And you so um, the the other thing that I want to know about, um, you know, and I know that you mentioned that uh, you've been doing this uh, for some time right now. For the brand new entrepreneurs or for somebody who is getting started and they just need that extra push and motivation, what advice would you give to somebody uh, for the uh, entrepreneurs out there that are listening? The first thing I would tell new entrepreneurs is to believe a lot faster. Believe a lot faster and, you know, put yourself around people that have the same beliefs as you. But I have a rule that if I go to a friend and, and I don't want y'all to take me wrong on this. You know, I'm still going to love them, but I'm going to keep my distance from them because you're not helping me. You know, we all have friends that we go to. We tell them about our business opportunity or we tell them that we're about to get our real estate license or something. And they're not very supportive. If you have friends that are not supportive, family members, I don't care who they are. Uh, sometimes you have to cut people off. You got to go with people. I never, let me just say this. That is something that I say a lot of times in my trainings because I train a lot as well because I have a team. I, have you ever seen an eagle fly with a buzzard? Mm. They both in the same sky, folks. Both in the same sky, looking for the same food up high. And no, I have not. <laughs> well, they're not looking for the same food. The eagle is looking for something alive. The buzzard is looking for something dead. Hmm. Wow, I, I, I gotta, you're gonna have to make me stop this radio show and do some thinking on my own, man. <laughs> so I, I say this, you know, the buzzer is looking for some somebody to just perish and die, all right? So a lot of times we have buzzer around us, buzzer friends. They just want us to die so we can be a buzzer like them. Are you following? Eagles, they fly by themselves. See, you only see buzzers flocking together. You never see an eagle even soaring with another eagle. Hmm. So the main thing, what I'm saying, is all mindset. Develop your own mindset and go after it with everything you got. With everything you got. Let's Brown, one of my mentors, say, only deal with OQP, only quality people. If they're not quality, cut them off. I like that. I like that. And uh, folks, for listening, uh, because if you're not already uh, checking this out on YouTube, Facebook, uh, eventually Spotify and such, um, this also goes with your virtual connections as well. So I'm doing this myself. So, hey, if you happen to see this, you're like, hey, I thought we used to be friends on Facebook. Nothing against you. Feel free to still follow, still free. I'm, I'm, I'm definitely reachable. If you need to send me a message, I'm definitely reachable. But you need to cycle out your friends because if all you're seeing through the day is the Will Smith case going on or, um, you know, too much gossip or uh, somebody's baby daddy and everything like that or the new girls twerking, you need to start cycling them out because that is actually going to shift your mindset to a better mindset and creating that wealth for you. I had to do it because definitely if you called me three or four years ago, I was definitely, what? Get it, girl, if you don't, get it, get it, get it, get it, get it. I was definitely that guy, definitely sharing away as far as what I could find. But I definitely had to change that because, you know, we need to focus on uh, for our next generation. We need to focus on for our community and building that back up. So um, don't get me wrong. You catch me on a Saturday night with a glass of wine. Hey, definitely it's going down. But um, throughout the rest of the 168, 62 hours of the week, uh, giving myself some time to party, you definitely want to make sure that you have that right mindset and you have those right connections. So, uh, Zavre, I can't uh, thank you enough. 
uh, for sharing that analogy uh, with the eagle and buzz. He's about to tell my own son that uh, so we can get it in his brain so he knows that uh, when schools decide to open back up, please, God, please. Um, <laughs> Let's pray on that. Let's pray on that. Let's pray on that. Yes. Yes, on just that, a moment. moment. Just <laughs> taking yeah. a moment out just for that. Um, but, you know, that he knows the difference going back into the school and having that mindset like, hey, is this person going to be soaring or is this person just waiting around for something dead to die to feed off of? So. Mm. Powerful, powerful, powerful. Um, well, man, it's, it's a blessing um, to, you know, be in your presence, my brother. I love connecting with brothers like yourself that's positive, that's flying on the same wavelength as I am. Um, hey, man, I'm trying to fly up and catch up to you, brother. Hey, <laughs> we like Mars Day right now. Right. Yeah. Hey, I'm telling my age a little bit. Now. Up. Up. <laughs> yeah. I'm now I'm showing my time. age. Now, now you got people like Mars Day. Good God, I don't understand. <laughs> Them guys are young. They old as hell. I don't know what. Right? Old folks don't know nothing. They probably even know what Google is. No, I'm kidding. Yeah, yeah. Hey, awesome. So, uh, Zara, before I let you go, please, uh, one more time for the folks at home, uh, how can folks uh, get in contact with you to learn more about uh, Burst Wealth Advisors? If you're looking to change and increase your cash flow, give me a call at 352-443-1396. Again, that number is area code 352443 one three nine six mention daniel Umstead radio show and i'm going to take care of you see you soon talk to you soon awesome i love that and uh for the folks at home check out the rng radio show monday through friday 7 a.m on facebook live or if you don't feel like getting up that early be sure to check out the youtube replay uh for interviews such as these and the uh, full radio show king zavre thank you again so much for being on the show good brother i appreciate you thank you king david i look forward to speaking with you soon my brother I, mean, David, I said David, but Daniel. King. No problem. Hey, listen, they was both kings in the Bible. Listen, you, you ain't jump off the cliff and say Billy or nothing like that. I'm taking the DA and that blessing. So it's all the same to me. <laughs> awesome, my awesome, my brother. Well, thank you again, my brother. Definitely. Have a good one, man. All right, you too, my brother. Stay safe up there now. Was led on the beat.